Um, and to pull a snoop on everybody, I want to thank me. Right? <laughs> I want to thank me. Like, you know, honestly, and you know what? Like, it's like we don't do this enough. I don't do this. Enough. All right, so we're here. We're here at Majestic Strength Studio. I'm here with JP. I'm gonna hit a leg workout, but I just grabbed JP because he's like clean, clean some mirrors. Because this is a new location. <laughs> maybe I should. Maybe we should show you. This is a new location, right? So you just put the mirrors up yesterday, was it? Yep. So you're cleaning them up. Lots of cleaning. Too much cleaning. So when, when did you uh, open up the, 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 the new location? This new location? The, uh, Am I in this well, video? The day that we physically moved in all the stuff yeah, yeah. was uh, November 24th. So yeah, if, if we would have had this planned out, I would have mic'd you up, but whatever. whatever. Uh, they, they can hear you. <laughs> yeah, November 24th would have been the, uh, the initial... But when, when, do you feel, when do you feel like you were here? Do you, still, do you feel like you're here yet? Honestly, you know what? That, was, that was a Thursday night that we finished with the, the physical move. Right. And uh, I trained clients that Saturday. Oh, shit. Right, right away, right? So, like, no screwing around. So, it's right? been a little while. Yeah. So, what else happened in February? It was What was it, your 11-year anniversary? 11-year anniversary, February 1st. There you go. That's uh, kind of surreal, right? Like, yeah. you know, it's uh, almost <laughs> feels like 100. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Is there anyone... I don't know. Well, this is not planned at all, so I'm just throwing them at JP here. So before, I, before I was just saying, I was just going to say I'm going to do a leg workout, but now I said, JP, let's just get no you in scripts. here. We, he doesn't like scripts. I don't <laughs> like scripts per se, but I like to know what I'm going to talk about. So, anyways, oh, so let's let's. <laughs> yeah. The topic is going to be right now, 11 year anniversary. Is there anything or anyone out there you want to thank or anything like that or anything you want to say to the people who support you or even to the people who have it? <laughs> you know what? It's, it's, it's funny because like I actually put that as part of my post, right? Like, it, you know, yeah. like there's, there's been a lot of people that, you know, like have come and gone over the years. Actually, you um, know what? You're in this mic. The funny thing is, right? Oh, yeah, right. Because I'm thinking, oh, yeah, it's going to be my camera. No, if I, if I mic it up. Oh, yeah, right. Just talking to this. Um, you can hold it if you want. Yeah, like there's like, you know, like, there's like the influencers doing TikTok. They just hold that thing up. So how are you today? Yeah, right. <laughs> um, there's, a, there's a lot of people that, that have come and gone over the years, right? And, uh, you know, realistically, like um, people that I never would have expected that have stuck around. Yeah. And um, people that I would have never expected to leave, right? That have actually left. And um, <laughs> it's the truth, no, it's true. right? It's you know, like it's the it. truth, it's life. And, uh, and honestly, like, you know, like you, you got to thank them both, right? Like you got to thank all, all, all the, the different people that have come and gone because, you know, like you wouldn't be, you know, at this stage where you're at now um, if it wasn't for all those experiences, right? Um, and to pull a snoop on everybody, I want to thank me. Right? <laughs> I want to thank me, like, you know, honestly, and you know what, like, it's like, we don't do this enough. I don't do this enough. Um, honestly, like, you know, like that, that Snoop video, I freaking love it because. I don't think I've ever seen it, but I know, I know exactly. You, you got to check it out. Never watched We're going to like insert that clip over here. Okay. Right. But last but not least, I want to thank me. <laughs> I want to thank me for believing in me. I want to thank me for doing all this hard work. I want to thank me for having no days off. I want to thank me for, for never quitting. I want to thank me for always being a giver and trying to give more than I receive. I want to thank me for trying to do more right than wrong. I want to thank me for just being me at all times. Snoop Dogg, you a bad but um, like honestly like it's like you know like if you hear what he's talking about like you know like I want to thank me for the late nights I want to thank me for grinding I would like you know like even when I thought that I shouldn't or like when I thought that I couldn't right you know like I want to thank me for persevering through the entire thing and whatever right and you guys have seen it before you guys have know about it whatever right but like I think that like, a lot of us we don't take enough time we don't take enough time to actually like you know um, recognize ourselves right like you know like I, I have to take enough time to recognize that um, um, although on a regular basis I kind of joke around and I'm kind of more self-deprecating and like whatever but you know at the same time too like I didn't get here by accident you know what I mean like so um, I want to thank me right I want to thank um, and I want to thank all my clients because like, if it's not for them I'm here by myself and I'm not doing shit for anything, right? So that's it. No, I like the thank me part. That's kind of like, what do they say? We never take time to smell the roses, right? No, seriously. We never do. Yeah. yeah. And that kind of segues to what I do, IDFA stuff. People don't appreciate the journey. They, they would ever yeah. step on stage and they just worry about 
what happens on that day and how the outcome is on that day. Yeah. What about the whole journey, like your yeah. journey to getting here yeah. the last 11 years, right? So, and the development of what's happened, you know, like mentally and emotionally to get you to this point, right? Um, you know, resiliency and strength comes from adversity at the end of the day, right? There you go. So, we unfortunately have to experience some of that in order to uh, to get to where we are. Yeah, leave it, leave us with a few words here, words of just whatever you want to leave us with. And also, how the hell do they get a hold of you? Where do they find you? Where the hell are you? Like, <laughs> yeah. where's this location, anyways? Right now, new location. This is, location is amazing. Like, this is like this is like busier plaza for sure. He doesn't call himself just Strength 2.0, but he pretty much this is 2.0 or even 3.0. He skips this is technically 2.0. my 3.0 now at this point, well, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 2.0 was over there. Like, you know, we had a couple of other ones on Woodbridge Avenue, right? But uh, yeah, I mean, like now this is in um, Martin Grove and Highway 7 uh, in the No Frills Plaza. I'm right beside Importer Gifts. Um, so you know, if you're from if you're familiar at all with the uh, West Woodbridge area, then uh, then you'll know what's up, right? So <laughs> pop in and say hi sometime. Um, you know, what's your social media? Uh, Majestic at Majestic Strength, uh, you can pretty Check much find show, everything. Yeah. Majestic Strength across the board um, on everything. Uh, I'm not active enough on TikTok, but I'm trying to be, right? Um, but it's Atmosphere and Majestic Strength. But have you seen well. the? Have you seen this guy's deadlift video? I'm gonna drop that in this video as well. <laughs> oh God! You really hope this doesn't make me look like a man when I'm done. Hopefully, it goes straight to my. Oh God! You want to see the deadlift videos? I think that's that's. Don't judge me. Yeah. It's a good video. <laughs> the things we do for the gram. Well, to be honest, I think this is probably my first video that has somebody else in it. Um, well, actually, yeah, you do do videos where there are two characters, but they're both you. I'm all the characters, <laughs> right? So you gotta check out his videos. Like, if you think you might, it's one of those things that you're gonna love it or you're gonna hate it. That's it. <laughs> that, but that's how you always want to be. You don't want to be on the fence. Yeah. Okay. Never be on the fence. Don't be you, in you, between. Don't be in between. You know, get Go some sort it. of reaction. Yeah, yeah. So either you're gonna love the videos or you're gonna hate the videos. That's either it. you're gonna love his sense of humor or you're gonna hate his sense. That's of humor. it. There you go. So it's majestic strength. Go to at majestic strength on Instagram. Yep. Instagram, TikTok, yeah, and you got a website, MajesticStrength.com. It's, it's all easy. It's all easy. So there's, there's basically no reason why, you, if you want to find him, you can't. You can't find That's him. That's it. And after you see his video, you're gonna want to subscribe to his channels. You're gonna there want you to go. subscribe to TikTok because <laughs> you got to inspire this guy to make more of those crazy videos. He puts his ass in the line and makes yeah. a fool of him. He makes a fool of himself. Yeah. And no one's gonna continue to make a fool of himself. And you know what? It's a lot if easier. We, if we don't, it's uh, a lot easier for us to make a fool of ourselves when we are the only person in the room. Right? Yeah. If you're trying true. to do yeah, something yeah. funny, silly, like, you know, like stupid or whatever, right? Okay, you're the only person in the room, right? Like, you know. Um, but with technology, day, you just hit send and now all of a sudden you're not the only person. That day, we had an entire audience, right? Like, we, we, must did? Have had, like, we had like 10 people here, <laughs> right? And like everybody heard what we were going to do and then they're like, oh, we're going to stick around, like to watch and whatever, right? It's just like, oh, shit. Right, and you so had like the tight pants and I, yeah. The, they're, they're, the, the, you know what the thing is though, I really like those tights, but not on you. Like <laughs> I love the, the black tights with the white stripes. Like they look really, they look, on girls they look great. There's a sports bra involved, just, I don't know. Just, yeah, you, you, by, by the time we're talking about this, you've probably already seen the video because I'm going to play it right here. That's it. So at least I got some good content. That's it. All right, so this is JP. I guess I better do a leg workout because now I just feel like talking, Let's go. talking shit, but I'm going to... We're going to jump into a leg workout, so um, yeah, stay tuned for that. Let's That's go. It.